Ready, set? You bet. My name is Marchibald. That's Janet Marie, and Where, where'd she go? Uh, she was right behind me. <sighs> Just a second. Let me go see if I can find her. Put my guitar down here. <clears throat> okay. Hello? Well, I don't get it. Uh, maybe she'll come around in a while. For right now, I think we better start the show. We're all ready, right? <clears throat> and so, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, my name is Marchibald. Jana Marie's around here someplace. We're from Children's Theater of Michigan. Here today to present... Imagination Celebration! Well, hooray, you made it! <laughs> Thank you, I did! <laughs> I was worried I was going to have to do the show all by myself. Uh, where where have you been? Oh, I've been around, and around, and around! <laughs> uh, sure. <laughs> I have, but you know what? That doesn't matter right now. What does matter is that I'm here... Uh -huh. And you're here, uh -huh. and everybody's here, so we're going to have a good time now. Let me see if I got this straight. Okay. Thank you. Would you help me out? Put your thumbs up in front of you like thumbs this. Thumbs up. Point them at your chest and say, I'm here. I'm here. Now take your pointer fingers, point them at us, and say, you're here. You're here. Now make a big sweep with your hands and say, everybody's here. Everybody's here. And now put them up at the sides, flare them out, and go, we're going to have a good time now. We're going to have a good time now. Exactly. Well, that's all you need to know exactly. for our first song of the show. And here's how it goes. Please, if you would, help us out. I'm here, you're here, everybody's here. We're going to have a good time now. All together. I'm here, you're here, everybody's here. We're going to have a good time now. We can muddle in a portal, we can flip to a tree. Float it like a bunch of flies, sing just like a bee. I'm here, you're here, everybody's here. We're going to have a good time now. We always like to play together. It's true, we do. We always love to see you smile. Say cheese. Cheese. When you join in, we all do better. Yep, 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 yep. So won't you come and join us for a while? You will? Ah, uh, thanks. We make a wild confabulation. A what? It's like a club. Uh Make us sing just like a choir. La, 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 la. Come on, join the show. Ready, steady, let's go. Take your deepest breath, my dears, and raise your voices higher. La. That was pretty good. Yeah. <clears throat> higher. La. Very pretty. Even higher. Sounds like a house on fire. I'm here, you're here, everybody's here. We're gonna have a good time now. All together. I'm here, you're here, everybody's here. We're gonna have a good time now. We can muddle in a puddle, we can flip to a tree. From 
Bouncing like a butterfly, sing just like a bee. I'm here, you're here, everybody's here. We're gonna have a good time now, now, now. We're gonna have a good time now, now, now. We're gonna have a good time. We're gonna have a good time. We're gonna have a good time now. And a big hand. Yes. <laughs> Great. Well, you know, you know and we know that the uh, summer reading theme this year is all about imagination mm -hmm. and about making up your own story and, and telling your own story, right? And, uh, well, this, I have to say, is a little bit odd for us, doing performances like this where we're here and you're there. Yeah, because it's kind of strange to see... You can see us, and you can do along with us, but we don't get to see you and do along with you. Yeah, and uh, it's almost like you're invisible, yeah. <laughs> which is kind of weird. Um, and uh, well, in, in the along the lanes, lines of uh, making up your own stories, this is uh, it, thinking about invisible and invisible. I think about invisible monsters because when I was a little kid, I wore glasses, really thick glasses. I couldn't see very well at all. And so when I went to bed at night, I took my glasses off and put them on the bedside table. And all of a sudden, everything I saw around me looked different. Mm -hmm. And so I imagined that they were monsters, the things that I saw. Yeah. And so I, I referred to them as my invisible monsters. And so we'd like to share this song and story with you and invite you to kind of echo along with us as well. Here's how it goes. <laughs> When you sit upright in the middle of the night and you feel a little worried about something that you've seen in the middle of a dream that is slimy or scaly or furry, look around your room in the midnight gloom. If you think it's wise to believe your eyes, think again, it's quite a different story. some observations. Everybody, if you would, echo along. imagination like me like me nicely done you know 
we've all been stuck in the house for a very long time. Oh. And I want so bad to take a trip. You want you want to take a trip? Yeah. <laughs> so uh, where where would you like to imagine you would go if you could go any place? Well, if I could go any place, I would like to go down by the river. By the river, Riverside? Exactly. Ah. You know why? Because there are so many wonderful creatures and animals that we could meet down there. For instance, when we're going down by the river, yeah. we can meet up with a gator in the water. Ooh. So everyone, put your arms out like so. You get some teeth here. Teeth. And what do gators do? They go snap, snap, snap. Well, let's try that. Snap, snap, snap. snap, snap. snap. Yeah. Exactly. And then we float a little further down the river, and there's a capuchin monkey who's waving at us. Can you all wave like oh, a Let's wave like monkey? monkeys. And what do they say? <laughs> <laughs> and then we look up in a treetop tall, and there's a bright red parrot going, ah, ah, ah. Oh, we can do that, right? Make a branch, and then put your parrot on the branch. Got it. And then go, <laughs> yes, very nice. Yeah. Last, but certainly not least, we meet up with Papa Anaconda. Papa Anna what? Papa Anaconda. What? What's an anaconda? What's, what's an anaconda? See, that's right. A really huge snake. Oh, man, snakes give me the willies. Oh, don't worry, though. This snake just wants to give you a big hug. Somehow getting a hug from a snake is not that comforting. <laughs> oh. Sorry about that. Yeah. yeah, so is everybody ready to what, do... What, do what, does, what does it oh, snakes what do say? Oh, what do snakes do? My bad. <laughs> snakes, what do they say? Hiss. Oh, what if we slither like the snake? Slither, too. Like slither and go, so hiss, slither, hiss, hiss. There you go. So here's how it goes. Help us out if you would, please. Oh, and then you can do a little swaying if you'd like. I think somebody forgot to give everybody their cue. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody, somebody did, Marchibald. Okay, maybe I forgot to give everybody <laughs> their cue. Okay, so what happens in each verse when we go, where are we going to go? We're going to listen like this, and we'd like you to put your pointer fingers up and say, I'm, I'm with the show. show. Okay, let's try that. Ready? Where, where are we going to go? We're going down by the river, by the deep green river. Where are we gonna go? I'm with the 
show. Ah, big round of applause. Woo! And a big hand. Big hand. Thank you. Now, I like rainforest animals and everything, but I think we should sing a song closer to home. I mean, about an animal closer to home. Oh, so like uh, squirrels? Yeah, there are a lot of squirrels, but no, um, some more even closer to home. Oh, like in the house? Yeah. Oh, you mean like our little puppy dog, Katie Doodoo? Exactly. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah but see, because Katie lives here in the north country where we live. She does. Not in the rainforest where, like, the gators and the monkeys live. And so they get hot all the time, but she always seems to be cold because she's got really short fur. <laughs> yeah, so she shivers a lot. Can you shiver? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and, uh, well, she also likes to sing along when we sing this song about something that we're going to do for her, okay? So if you would, listen and join in. Here we go. My doggy needs a sweater. My doggy needs a sweater. Her hair's too short. Hair's too short. She 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 shivers when the wind she, she, she shivers when the wind blows. She's a pretty good sport. She's a pretty good sport. Her coat would be warmer. Her coat would be warmer. She was born up north. She was born up north. My doggy needs a sweater. My doggy needs a sweater. Her hair's too short. Hair's too short. I don't know. I think I gotta get her a pretty little jacket or a nice long sweater. Some little puppy boots or some cute little mittens. Hey, I know. Maybe I'll ask those three little kittens. Oh, I don't know that that would work. Why not? Don't you remember what happened to them? Oh, yeah. They, they lost, lost them. them. My doggy needs a sweater. My doggy needs a sweater. Her hair's too short. Her hair's too short. She, she, she shivers when the wind she, she, she blows. But she's a pretty good sport. She's a pretty good sport. Her coat would be warmer. Her coat would be warmer. She was born up north. If she was born up north. My doggy needs a sweater. My doggy needs a sweater. Her hair's too short. Hair's too short. I could get my knitting needles and a little ball of yarn. I could knit her up a sweater that would keep her nice and warm. Only trouble is by the time I got it done, be the middle. Uh, can you tell us what does it say? I can. Here we go. Hey, Mom and Dad, I don't want you to worry. I went down to Miami and I left in quite a hurry. It's chilly on the beach, though I'm lying in the sun. I could use a sweater. Won't you please just send me one? My doggy needs a sweater. My doggy needs a sweater. Hair's too short. Hair's too short. She, she, she shivers when the wind blows. She, she shivers when the wind And a big hand. Yes, thank you. Well, you know, between singing and imagining and bopping around, you yes. know, I don't know about anybody else, but I get a little worn out, and so I think this would be a great time to take a nap. So no, we're going to sing no, a little song no, about no, taking wake a up, nap. No, no, I heard you, Mom and Dad. No, we're not taking a nap. No nap? No, no naps. You're kidding. No naps, no. We're here to have fun uh, okay. and to energize. Okay, okay, okay. So if we're not going to take a nap, what do you think? You, what do you, what do you want to do? Um, well, quite honestly, I'm a little hungry. You're hungry? Yeah. So I think maybe we should sing a song about one of my favorite foods. One of your favorite <laughs> foods. Yeah. Uh, one hint. Uh, yes, I would love a hint. Okay. Broccoli. Broccoli. Isn't it just called broccoli? Well, it can be, but it's a lot more fun when you say broccoli. It is? Yeah. In fact, on the count of three, I think we should all try it. Say it all together. Ready? One, two, 
three broccoli. See? And I don't know about you, but if you try say that, you just naturally smile, feel better. It's true. And so yeah, oh that's a great one. You know, it's it's as much fun to play with as it is to to say and to eat. When our biggest little boy, Devin Devin, who is now this big, true. was about this big. You know what his favorite food was? Anybody want to give it a guess? Broccoli. You got it. Exactly. And he liked to believe that broccoli were trees, mm-hmm. because if you ever look at it, it kind of looks like a tree, right? So, and he began thinking as a kid of about five or six years old, um, what kind of animal would be big enough to eat a tree in perspective if it was that big? And so he thought, well, it had to be a long-necked dinosaur. So this is what he did. And you could do that with us if you would. So he took his arms and he reached them way up in the air like that to make like a, a neck, a dinosaur neck. And he put a head on top, he put teeth in the mouth, and then he bent way down and he munched on broccoli. <laughs> yeah. He loved that stuff. It's true. Yeah. And he also liked to sing along with us, and he would sing, Broccoli. Can you try that? Broccoli. Just like that. Well, now that you know the things we'd like you to do, if you would please join in, keep an eye on Janet Marie, make the long neck dinosaur, and sing along with us. And here's how this one goes. <laughs> good of eating food if you're never eating food it's fun to say I know. everyone let your tongue have some fun have a little bit of broccoli every day and sing out i love broccoli when i eat broccoli i feel like i'm a dinosaur munching on a tree when i eat broccoli 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 that's how it goes ready i love When I eat broccoli, broccoli, Oh, I eat it every day, it's true. I might try some cabbage or some celery, too. Celery? Well, I might. I mean, I never used to like broccoli till I tried it. Spinach. Mm. I really love my spinach. I feel like I'm a seahorse munching seaweed in the sea. But as long as we try something green like lettuce or some lima beans, we're sure to grow up big and strong. Really, as for me, I love broccoli. Won't you sing with me? I love broccoli when I eat broccoli. Feel like I'm a dinosaur munching on a tree. When I eat broccoli, broccoli, broccoli. Nicely done. Give yourselves a round of applause, little dinosaurs. Yes. And a big hand. And a big hand. Very nice. (laughs) Well, you know. Now that we've had a little broccoli, I think, are we ready to go on with the show? Uh, uh, What's the matter? Um, nothing, I'm fine. You you sure? Well, okay, I ate one too many pieces of broccoli. Oh, man, so you got a little bellyache? Yeah, boy. Yeah. Yeah, you do. Just a little one. So, but but you're going to be okay to continue? Yeah. Yeah. Does she look like she's going to be okay to you? Yeah. Yeah, I don't think so. You know, she's kind of got that owie face going, you know. Oh, yeah. Did you ever notice that when somebody makes an owie face at you, that you just kind of naturally make an owie face back? Have you ever noticed that? Yeah. If you checked yourself in the mirror right now, I bet you some of you would be making owie faces. Or, or for instance, if somebody makes a, a really angry face at you, really angry, you know, 
You, you might have a tendency to make an angry face back, and it would make you feel worse, right? Yeah. Or, or if somebody makes a smiley face at you, even if you're not feeling all that great that day, you might smile back, <laughs> and you might feel a little bit better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, uh, well, we would like to sing a little song. This is kind of a story and song that we'd like to share with you about smiling and feeling better. So, okay. first of all, we need to see your best, biggest smile. Let's see a big... That's a good one. Got some good ones out. Yeah, excellent. Okay, now let's see your crampy, crankiest, grumpiest. I tried to say cranky and grumpy at the same time. Got crampy. Crankiest, grumpiest face ever. Let's do a cranky, grumpy. Oh, that's, yeah, well, that's terrifying. Okay. Well, let's, so let's, we won't start out with that quite yet. Give your face muscles a rest. Okay. 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 And so we're going to sing a song about how smiling might make you feel better. Okay, okay. is everybody ready? So start out with that grumpy, cranky face. Here we go, and here's how this song goes. Whenever you are grumpy, or cranky, or crabby, whenever you are pouty, or whiny, or blue, it feels like there's a big gray gooby cloud hanging around you. You know that there is only one way the sunshine through. You've got to smile. Let's see a smile now. He's got to grin. Show us a grin. He's got to wiggle. Let the butterflies begin. Butterflies in your belly. You've got to smile. Show us a smile. Everybody back to crabby faces. Very nice. Second verse. Whenever you are angry or just not too happy, the way you look affects everyone who sees you. Ooh, you might not even know it, but the way you appear really matters. It really does. So try to cheer up. Show some teeth and smile. Let's go smile. You got to grin. You got to giggle. Let the butterflies be here. Butterflies in your belly. You got to smile. And then you will know that the star that you share will come back to you and follow wherever you go. So far, so good. What can we do? I know. Family photo. Oh, let's try it. Ready? Everyone, say, say cheese. cheese. Works every time. You've got to smile. Show us your smile. You've got to grin. Put on a grin. You've got to giggle. Let the butterflies be here. <laughs> in your belly. You've got to smile. Show us that smile when you Everybody. Nicely done. Give yourselves a round of applause. And of course, a big hand. A big hand. Thank you. Well, all right then. So let's see. We've had a little snack. Yes. We had some broccoli. Mm -hmm. Okay. And we got a little belly ache. Yeah. And we smiled a little bit. So telling a lot of different stories here from the reality of our lives. Yeah. And so part of the reality of my life is that I like to take naps. So no, I think no, it's time to take a nap. We're not taking a nap. You always want to take a nap. Yeah. Who here wants to take a nap? Oh. Yeah, I do. Well, okay, okay. Yeah, and we saw some of them want to take a nap. Exactly. Too. So perhaps we ought to, but let's not for right now. Instead, let's sing a song about taking a nap. Okay, let's sing a song okay. about taking a nap. Let me get rid of this because I need some extra movability. You got it. All okay. right. So, in this song, what we're going to do is sing about a way to go to sleep because sometimes, no matter how sleepy I am, no matter how much I would like to take a nap, I just cannot get to sleep. Well, then what do you do? But I count sheep. Uh -huh. 
Does it work? Well, when the sheep cooperate, yeah. Well, what happens when they don't cooperate? I'm glad you asked, because that's what the song is about. Now, see, um, everybody knows what sheep say, right? Can we all sing what sheep say? Ready? <laughs> oh. Just like that, exactly. But the sheep I have are very silly sheep. They do not ba. They sing and dance. And what they do is they stand on their back hooves like this, okay, and they put their hooves up in front of them, and they do this. They go, ba, 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 and they waggle their little sheepy okay. tails. Let's, Let's all try Let's that, try that, shall we? Here we go. And ba 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 ba, just like that. And you know, um, now what I what I do is with these sheep is that I count them. Okay. And uh, have you ever counted sheep to go to sleep? No. Okay. Yep. Well, this is how you do it. Okay. What you do is you lie in bed and you cuddle up. Can you cuddle up? Yeah. Mm. And you imagine that you see a whole flock of sheep over here, okay. right? And then in the middle, there's a fence. All right. Okay? And then you imagine that the sheep jump over the fence, and as they do, you count them. So count with me, if you would. We go, one, two, three. And by the time you get to four, you ought to be asleep, <sighs> except for the singing sheep. Yeah, yeah, see, and so what we, what we do is, because we, we try and count them and maybe we'll get to go to sleep, but here's the deal. First of all, since this is the counting sheep song, this is what these silly sheep do besides singing and dance. So we go one little sheep, this one peeks around the corner. So grab the corner and peek around. Yeah, like that. Okay, and then two little sheep watch TV. So like you're laying on your building watching TV, like that, right? Yeah. And the third sheep is always thirsty, so he holds a glass up in the air like this, and he goes, I want a drink of water. Can you try that with us? Ready? I, I want, want a drink, drink of water. water. And the fourth sheep is the silliest of all. He tickles me. So take your fingers like that and tickle and laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Just like that, okay? And then, of course, they sing and dance. So if you're ready, would you uh, sure. tap the band in the box, please? Let's find it. There we go. Okay, shake it out a little bit and count with me. Try it with me, will you please? We go. On those nights when I can't sleep, somebody told me I ought to count sheep. Count my little sheep is jumping over the fence. Well, that could make me sleepy, and that makes sense. But what if those sheep won't jump that fence at all? What if they'd rather go sneaking off down the hall? Let me tell you about it. There's one little sheep peeking around the corner and two little sheep watching TV. Three little sheep say, I want a drink of water. And four little sheep are tickling me. Oh yeah, there's one little sheep peeking around the corner and two little sheep watching TV. Three little sheep say, I want a drink of water. And four little sheep are tickling me. I don't know why, but I can't get past four. They tickle, I giggle, I fall off the floor. When I do, Mama says, Get back in bed. I say, I can't sleep. And she says, Try counting sheep. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, brother. Ready? Ba, 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 ba. Second verse. I say, Mom, the sheep are acting funny. And she says, Get back in bed now, honey. Everyone knows those sheep are in your head. I say, well, tell that to the ones that are jumping on my bed. She just smiles and turns out the light. And those sheep keep me up till the middle of the night. See, there's one little sheep peeking around the corner in. Two little sheep watching TV. Three little sheep say, I want a drink of water. Four little sheep are tickling me. Oh, yeah, there's one little sheep. Peeking around the corner in two little sheep watching TV. Three little sheep say, I want a drink of water. And four little sheep are tickling me and they sing, ba 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 One more time, ba 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 Take a bow, sheepy. Good.
Good job, good take job. Take a bow, take a bow. And give yourselves a big hand. Well, we had some good time there, even though I didn't get a nap. Yay! Oh, sorry. And neither did any of you. If you were looking forward to a nap, you'll have to take one later. Uh, <laughs> but you know what? I think since we didn't get our nap, I think that we ought to do here is that we ought to sing some songs about my favorite critters in the whole wide world. Okay, your favorite critters yeah. in the whole wide world. Yeah, and those are bugs. No. Yeah, they are, I promise. They're, the bugs Archibald, are, I love bugs. again, yeah. remember, yeah. I've told you this before, mm -hmm. there ain't no bugs on me. I'm sorry, what was that? I said, there ain't no bugs on me. That's what I thought you said. Now, there may be bugs on some of you mugs, but there ain't no bugs on me. Huh. Can we try that? Let's see if we can do that, too, all right? There ain't no bugs on me. That's right. Okay. There ain't no bugs on me. Yeah, you're getting it. Okay. Now, there may be bugs mm -hmm. on some of you mugs. Make that really big. Ready? Some of you mugs. Right. Yeah. But there ain't no bugs on me. Exactly. That's it. Well, yeah. we happen to know a song that goes like that. And if you would, please help us out. Okay. Get those motions going. Here we go. So there ain't no, ain't no bugs, you know, there ain't no bugs on me. There may be bugs on some of you mugs, but there ain't no bugs on me. Talking about ain't no, ain't no bugs, you know, there ain't no bugs on me. There may be bugs on some of you mugs, but there ain't no bugs on me. How about a cute, pretty bug first? Ladybug, ladybug, you better fly away home. I want my Bobby. Oh, there ain't no, ain't no bugs. You know there ain't no bugs on me. There may be bugs on some of you mugs, but there ain't no bugs on me. Talking about ain't no, ain't no bugs. You know there ain't no bugs on me. There may be bugs on some of you mugs, but there ain't no bugs on me. I know. How about a mosquito bird? Mosquito, she fly high. Mosquito, she fly low. Mosquito better not come fly by me, or she won't fly no more. Oh, talking about ain't no, ain't no bugs, you know there ain't no bugs on me. There may be bugs on some of you mugs, but there ain't no bugs on me. Talking about ain't no, ain't no bugs, you know there ain't no bugs on me. There may be bugs on some of you mugs, but there ain't no bugs. Everybody knows how many legs a bug has, right? Insects have six legs, right? Except for a few of them. This is a verse about one of those. This is a bug that has no legs. And it goes like this. Ooey gooey was a worm. A mighty worm was he. He laid upon the railroad track. The train you did not see. Cows don't fly. <laughs> there ain't no, ain't no bugs, you know, there ain't no bugs on me. There may be bugs on some of you mugs, but there ain't no bugs on me. Last time there ain't no, ain't no bugs, you know, there ain't no bugs on me. There may be bugs on some of you mugs, but there ain't no bugs on me. There may be bugs on some of you mugs, but there ain't no bugs on me. Give yourselves a round of applause. And it began. Whew. 
I'm going to get a drink of water. <laughs> I think he swallowed a bug, right? Mm. <laughs> Delicious. Mm. I, don't, I love them, but I don't love to eat them. <laughs> okay, I have an idea. What? Instead of talking about <clears throat> bug bugs, yeah. how about if we sing a song about pretty bugs? Pretty bugs, beautiful bugs. There you go. Beautiful oh. bugs indeed. Yeah. You know which what ones, What kind of right? bugs are they? Butterflies. Butterflies, exactly. yeah. Exactly. So we can be a butterfly like this. Yeah. Or we can be a butterfly like this. Absolutely. Or we can spread our wings or up and down. Whichever way you'd like to be a butterfly. Yeah. A beautiful butterfly. And here's how this one goes. But before we start singing it, we have oh. to remind them about these little butterflies. Oh, yeah. I forgot. See, because they know that they're the prettiest bugs out there. Yeah, that's true. So they have a habit of, well, kind of being teasing, like, you know. And they take their little wings like this. And they go like, what do they say, Archibald? They oh, go, I remember. Na, 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 boo boo. Of course he would remember. Yeah, Let's they Let's try that together. Yeah, brings up. Na, 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 boo boo. Just like that. Yes. You'll know when that comes in. Please feel free to join in. For the time being, let's fly. Oh, right. Sunrise soaring through the blue sky. Fly fast, low. Everybody but the butterfly knows. It's a little butterfly in show. When we show off our colors shine, shining like a rainbow. And when we cry, through the sunshine, we'll have high times. Raining at the little bugs who are looking up at us and wishing they were butterflies. Do you know what to do, ready? Jump and fly, every button of the blue the sky. What's the point of being butterflies? If we can't show them what we've got, bashful babies, we're not. Spread out wide, any room you expect to fly. And there's room for the butterfly. On the current of the soft spring and breeze, ready, steady, bye bye. Okay, now we're gonna fly a little bit. Sunrise soaring through the blue sky. Fly up and blow. Every black and black butterfly knows it's another butterflying show. When they show off the colors shine, shine like a rainbow. And when we fly through the sunshine, we'll have high times. Grinning at the little bugs who are looking up at us, wishing they were butterflies. Do what do they say? They go. And a big hand. There you go. Thank you. Now, you know, whenever we travel, and we haven't been traveling as much for the last <laughs> ooh, five months or so, yeah. but wherever we go, we find that, that kids are learning new stuff and doing new stuff. And, uh, well, we've, we've learned about this thing that we don't really understand. It's called TikTok. You know yeah. what TikTok is? Yeah. yeah. Kind of. Oh, kind of. So basically, what our nieces and our nephews, uh, what they explain to us is this. Uh, that what it is is that there's songs and you everybody learns the dances and you dance along with them and then you make your own videos and you join them in. Well, we thought about a song which is a, sort of like a buggy song but not a buggy song. And this is like the most famous arachnid song in the yeah. history of the world. And an arachnid, what is an arachnid? It's an arachnid, it, it, yeah. Yeah, a spider, exactly. right? Okay. Now, don't worry, this is not like a, a giant spider like in a monster <laughs> movie. And it's not like a medium-sized spider like a tarantula. This is an eensy beansy spider. spider. Yeah. So everybody, like, kind of like TikTok, this is like the, the like 
old school TikTok. Every kid learned it and did it exactly the same way or very closely. So what you're gonna do, first of all, do the eensy beansy, got that thing, got that thing crawling up the water spout, and then down came the rain, right? Yep. And then what? Wash the spider out. And then out came the sun and dried up all the rain, and then we go back to the eensy beansy spider, all right? Yeah. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do the song the way you know it, and then we've got a little twist for you too. Okay, okay. ready? Get those eensies up. The eensy beensy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And the eensy beensy spider went up the spout again. Okay, let's do it one more time through. All right, but this time make sure you get that sun up to dry out the rain. Ready? The eensy beensy spider went up the water spout. As Marchibald said, there is a little twist. So we have an eensy beensy spider that grew up in the rainforest. Yeah, in a banana tree. Exactly. So we thought that we would teach you the movements to that. And then we'd like to ask you to TikTok it away, right? Yeah, yeah. Try to join in. Well, in fact, we're going to post the, the eensy beensy, this next eensy beensy spider song. And let's see what we can do with it. All, All right. right. So this eensy beensy, it's still the same eensy beensy, right? But you've got to weave up your mess like so, knees and arms. Then you got to look sharp like you're looking out of binoculars. Yeah? Or you'll never see. Shake that finger and that hip. And then use that eensy beensy. You guys got it? All right, here we go. Ready? The eensy beensy spider in the banana tree Weaving up the nest for her family You better look sharp or you never see The eensy beensy spider in the banana tree You better look sharp or you never see The eensy beensy spider in the banana tree You did really well, but let's do it one more time to help you put it to memory. You got it? Okay, shake out. Get those eensies. Here we go. The eensy beensy spider in the phone and a tree. We lit up the nest for her family. You better look sharp or you'll never see. The eensy beensy spider in the phone and a tree. You better look sharp or you'll never see. The eensy beensy spider in the Bonanna tree. Take a bow, Nicely done. Nicely done. Give yourselves a round of applause. Woo! <laughs> May not and be. A big hand. Hand. And remember to TikTok the Bonanna tree. Yep. Bincy Bincy. Yep. Yes. All righty. Now then, um, you know, in the summer, well, all the time, really, we like to go outside and play, right? Yeah, that's why we did the show outdoors. Even though it's a library show and normally we'd be inside, we decided to play outside today. Yeah, and so we'd like to ask <laughs> you to play along with us, and you'll know what to do as we sing along, okay? You all guys right. ready? Here we go. Get up and move around a little bit here. <laughs> Anything we're gonna swing in on the back of y'all swing, cause that's how we like you to ready? play. Okay. We're gonna swing in on the back of y'all swing, we're gonna swing in like anything. We're gonna swing in on the back of y'all swing, cause that's how we like to play. We go high, 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 high up to the sky, high, high, high. It's like we fly. Down, down to the ground Then we roll 
Begin. Let's swing. We go and swing it on the backyard swing. We go and swing it like anything. We go and swing it on the backyard swing. Cause that's how we like to play. We go and sliding down the backyard slide. We go climbing up a way up high. We go and sliding down the backyard slide. Cause that's how we like to play. Yes, that's how we like to play. <sighs> Nicely done. Give yourself a round of applause. Yes, indeedy. And Have a big, a big hand. hand. <laughs> Have to get the hair out of my mouth. Whew. Yes. Well, it's about the end of our little visit for today. It is indeed. Yeah. Yeah. We hope you've had a little bit of fun. We hope that you're going to spend the summer reading and spending some time outside swinging and playing and singing and having fun. We hope that we get to see you up close and personal uh, and in person really, really soon. But for right now, if you would please... We'd like to have everybody stand up right where you are. Yep. This is our famous last song of the show. And usually, you know, you do this in a big circle. But wait a minute. Are mom and dad and big sister and brother still in the house? Yeah. You want to grab them really fast? Yeah. 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 Bring so everybody down. So we can all down. do this together. Yeah. All right. In the meantime, those of you that are all ready, let's just shake it out. Yeah? Okay. You ready? I am. Here's how it goes. up high in the air like Jana Marie's doing. Let's shake them down. Ready? You do the hokey pokey. You do the hokey pokey. You do the hokey pokey. That's what it's all about. Okay, what should we do next? How about our heads? Oh, yeah. You put your head in. You put your head out. You put your head in. And you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey. Backside. You put your backside in. You put your backside out. You put your backside in. And you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey. Turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Your whole self. You put your whole self in. You put your whole self out. You put your whole self in. And you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey. Turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Okay, everybody, hands up again. Let's shake them down. Ready? You do the hokey pokey. You do the hokey pokey. You do the hokey pokey. Three times now. That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. Nicely done. Give yourself a round of applause. And a big hand. And take a bow. Take a bow. And ladies and gentlemen, that's Jana Marie. And that's Mark Jamal. We're from Children's Theater of Michigan. If you would, please do whatever Jana Marie does to keep the rhythm. Ready? Here we go. See you later, refrigerator. Though it's been fun, the time has come for us to go. Toodaloo, you kangaroo. We hope you've had a laugh or two throughout the show. And we'd like to say you made our day and sent us smiling on our way 
For you're the reason for the play we do. See you later, refrigerator to the